Hey, it's Austin. I just wanted to share with you an HE351 turbo upgrade that we do. This has a 67 by 89 by 95 millimeter compressor wheel. It's a, a billet compressor wheel. As you can see, it has a narrowed hub. <clears throat> uh, the only thing I need to mention about this that I didn't like that we had to do is that we did have to cut this a little bit so that we could put this compressor housing on the machine. Other than that, you still have a little bit of the bevel, so it will seal properly with the intercooler pipe. Uh, with the turbine wheel, we use the 67 by, um, by 76 millimeter turbine shaft. Of course, it gets a little close to the flapper area, but we just smooth that and round it out so that we won't have any issues with it cracking there. So, um, as far as what this thing can do, uh, <clears throat> on a gas engine, we know we can make 850 horsepower out of it. With this thing stock, we were seeing the 580, but it was choking a little bit up top. And what this turbo came factory had a 60 by 86 millimeter compressor wheel on it. And then the turbine had a uh, 58 by 70 millimeter turbine on it. And that was basically an HY35 turbine. This is the same upgrade for the HE351 and the HE341. Uh, the difference between the HE341 and the HE351 is some of the HE341s had a HX35 compressor wheel, which is the same as HY35 wheel, which is um, 54 by 78 millimeter. And then some of the HE341s had a uh, 56 by 78 by yeah by 78 millimeter compressor wheel, but. Uh, if you like what we do here, please check out our other videos and subscribe to our channel.